Okay, hello and welcome to something new. Uh, what we're doing here is we're playing Football Manager 2020, not 2021, because I don't have 2021, I only have 2020. Uh, but we're doing a Football Manager save with Dagenham and Redbridge FC. The biggest London club by a mile. I mean, I know people are like, oh, Arsenal's the biggest London club because their history Spurs are, Chelsea are. Burn all that off, mate. I know Chelsea just won Champions League, Spurs shush you guys you're not a big club but Dagenham and Redbridge big club uh yeah so we're starting off in the national league uh as you can see here there's the league table so we've got the likes of um like Yeovil, Rex and Woking right, you can see all of them uh Harrogate Town so you see this obviously is old because Harrogate Town and uh Barrow as well as another one of these teams there's any of these teams up in the EFL at the moment, just Harrogate and Barrow, I think it is just Harrogate and Barrow out of here that now EFL teams, yeah, I think that's it, because I know uh, Torque just got promoted, I think, I'm not sure, anyway, uh, yeah, so this is Dagenham and Redbridge FC, uh, I'm really bad at football manager. I don't know what I'm doing. So this is just going to be like a complete newbie doing football manager. Uh, as you can hear, we've got some some chill music in the background because it's just a sit back, play some football manager and vibe. It's not going to be intense. It's not going to be crazy. We're just going to vibe, have some fun. Hopefully, get good and win some games. Uh, so let's let's meet the squad. So we have. Let's see who have we got. Um. That's so we've got keepers of Justin. His morale is extremely poor. Uh Strizovic, uh, it's over. let's have a look at these guys. So twenty eight year old Englishman. Uh, valued at fifty six K so decent. I mean he, he looks decent. Uh Strizovic, not as good, but he's only twenty, so I like, will obviously give him time and, and try and build him up. Uh Sukuni, Congolese. Uh he looks pretty good. Uh, 33 years old though, so doesn't have many years left of his prime left in him. Penny Clark, a 30 year old, looks it's all right. Uh, you know, let's not go through everyone. What does this mean when he's the blue name? I don't know. 23 years old though, Alex Reed. So we got some decent looking players here though. That's that's the main thing. Uh, obviously, I don't know what the team is like in terms of like starting lineup, but uh, we'll get to that when we get through into some games but anyway we have a must respond here uh let's negotiate the uh you know what i think that all looks good to me personally i think we're good so i'm gonna confirm that next uh yeah i think that's good so let's continue Okay, oh, we have something in our inbox. Let's have a read of that social feed. Okay, that's cool. Let's just tell them what it is. Uh, okay, that that looks good to me. I like that. So we're just gonna keep going. Uh, what do we got here? Okay, injury update. So torn ankle ligaments unknown, but it could be eight weeks to three months. Timeout so far five months. That's a big injury. Hopefully we can get him back. Okay, so that's looking all good. I'll introduce myself to the squad. Okay. So Kenny Clark, I'm guessing, is our captain. Yeah. I'm gonna be calm, just be casual. Be happy with everyone, just be just not gonna get too intense, just sort of say, You're right lads, how's it going? All that sort of stuff.
So uh, that's that's good. We we've we've improved some morale. Like uh, he's gone up quite high. Uh, he's gone up by a bit just from you know fairly good to extremely good. Uh, that's another fairly good to extremely good. Well, that's uh, very good, not extremely good. Uh, but then like that's gone up to good. So we 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 we've, we've raised some morale just to start, which is nice. It's what you want to do. So. No team leaders, which is a problem, but we have highly influential players like Clark, Robinson, and uh, Zakawani. Ooh, let's just keep on going. Make induction. Uh, okay, I can't be bothered. That, I'll be honest. Uh, we've got a friendly against Hibernian. All right, so let's uh, attend the press conference. What are your initial thoughts on taking the Dagenham and Redbridge job? Get into it. It's a massive club, it is. It's the biggest club in London, what can I say? Oh yeah, this is, I think, just 20. When this goes out, I'm going to be like a couple of days of 22 and this game's like, sorry, you're only 20. Oh, God. I have my actual date of birth in this, uh, which is kind of mad. I kind of want to go back on that one. I didn't mean short term. I, I didn't read the end of it. See, I normally go the one at the top two because that seems uh, that seems to be the most positive ones. Just type in it. You can just type in what you want. That's mad. I'm happy with my squad you know I'm not gonna be like you know what I want to replace this part of the squad and this part of the squad because that's gonna be a dick to those parts of the squad so I'm just gonna say you know what I'm happy for now I'm not gonna comment on it uh... let's keep that private I don't think we need to discuss my internal policy. There we go. What are the media going to think of us? Yeah, they're saying excited, and we are. That's us. Look at how handsome fella there. The customization of your manager in this game is, is really limited. It would be nice to get some more. I don't know if there is more in uh, 2021. Be cool if there is, but uh, no, I understand. It's like not a big point. It's like not a big focal point of, of the game. So yeah, it's, it's nothing major, but it's it would still be nice. All right, I think we need to. Oh, just what you don't want. Okay, it's only nine to twelve days, so that that's that's okay. Keep going. Okay, I'm just gonna finish that because I've done this all before in uh, other in other saves, so I don't really need to go through all of that sort of stuff. Oh, save in the game. I'll wait for that. I'm not gonna turn auto save off because having it on is just so useful. 
Okay, so that's how Chris uh, Chesterfield will uh, be looking. Who net transfer spend four pounds? How do you even spend four pounds? What do you even spend four pounds on? Talking of transfers, let's look at some scouting. Okay. Estimated wage is quite high. About 475k, so like we're we not getting that. Um I think maybe we look at like some some League Two players. Maybe even some like um some like National League South and North players. Be like a Bournemouth player, like is uh, when we look at him he's valued 165k which is just far above what we can afford and so like that's that's the problem i do have to uh probably gonna have to use the bar to scroll for the most part uh because my scroll wheel is broken but should only be a few days well i know it's only gonna be a few days and i'm getting a new mouse i've got one on the way Oh, look at this guy, about 97k. How much do we have? Um, a 25k transfer budget and 2.5k uh, wage budget. So we're like, we need to really lower our, lower our thoughts here. Um, like, have anyone contract expired? There we go. That could be. And we could see like bring people in. Okay, so like he's pretty old, so we've already done but, like we would like look for someone who's a bit younger. Um could we edit search, yes we can. So let's say put that age down to like somewhere between fifteen and twenty nine, so like under thirty. Um Fire means free agent. Joe Anderson, 29 years old, what position does he play? He's a, a left defender. I think we're going to go into a game and see what we need uh, before, before, I think, um, tactics. I think, uh, what kind of tactics? I don't want to play Park the Bus football. Route 1, I think, could work. Or wing play. Yeah, I quite like wing play personally, so I think we're going to go with that. I think wing play works well with like a. A 4 2 4 wide could be good. But I think maybe a 4 1 4 1. That's a similar to the 424, except we have two people here. Uh, maybe a 442 actually, just a standard 442 could work. I think. I think a 442. I think we just go pretty solid with a 442. It's standard, it's um basically what you'd expect. So pick player, I think we're gonna go with him and then um on holiday but that's fine we'll go with liam gordon to start uh zanuki he's out so we're gonna have to go with uh on arias and will Wright to start uh alexander mcqueen what a name uh so wide attacking looks like sam deering Good shout, Mitch Brundle looks like it could be a good shout there. And uh, I say we could play Matt Robinson there. Miles Weston, uh, Ben House, and then Alex Reed. I think that looks pretty good. So there we'll have um, Rizovic as our second choice keeper. And I'll leave out the two injured guys for now. 
There's like a left center or defender. Get another one. Then. Uh, then a wide defender. Uh, get some midfield players. So I get a defensive mid in there. And an attacking mid. Uh, left mid. Then we should get some options in strike. There, so we have Grant and uh, Quigley. Three more spots. I think we can um, sort of distribute a bit more around the places. There's only going to be a couple players left out for the moment. Uh, we can get this guy in. He looks like he could be alright. And actually look over these guys. Okay, this guy looks better at 105k. Right, I think I think we start this guy here and move him forwards into a more advanced role. Hmm, I don't think the 442 would work with that. Um, let's go back. Okay, let's go. Okay, no, no, I think I think we should we should try it. He's clearly like a a high quality player. I mean, he's valued one hundred and five k. And you think like forty eight point five k was one of our high? It was one hundred seventy five k though. Damn. So we have some, we have some valuable players here. Uh, which which is nice. So we do have a few older players that you see like um the likes of uh well Weston here, 31. Uh which again older we have some younger ones like here. A queen twenty-four, so still pretty young. Wright's only twenty-two. On is only twenty-two. Gordon's only twenty. Liam Gordon, why do I recognise your face? I, I think you might have been in a FIFA game maybe. His face just looks familiar, like I've seen it. Uh, maybe I've seen it for manager before. And like twenty-eight. So oh, we have some, we have some solid, solid players here. Um, I think the last spot will go to uh, the eighteen k, eight point seven five. So we should go for the more valuable. But I like the look of that, and that's pretty, pretty solid. Um, just keep going. This is annoying. One to six days. Timeouts are oh, four days. So he could be back quite soon, actually. Uh, do we have anything recurring injuries? We don't. Okay, we're just going to keep going. We're gonna go uh, transfers again, scouting even. Uh, player search, and then yeah. What was it? Was it Joe Anderson? Yeah, left defender who's been bid for by Eastley, who are uh, in the same league as us. So I think, I think we could, I think we could go in for him. Uh, can we just yeah approach the sign? Yeah, yeah, I know this stuff. I've I've done it before. I think we should go with that, and then see if we can get that down to like five hundred four fifty. Let's suggest terms. Go down to seven hundred. There we go. I think that's alright. I'm happy with that. So, we'll, we'll see. Could come through good, it might not. Okay. Uh, 
Oh, okay. But you can see all of the games going on. It's just uh, it's pre-season games, so like, you know, Arsenal playing Bayern, Aldershot playing Swansea. Um, what else is there? Anything? Anything interesting? Wolfsburg playing Barnsley. That's something you wouldn't expect to see. Uh, Boreham Wood playing Bournemouth under twenty threes. A different one. Uh, any big teams? There's us. Um, see if there's any of the Prem teams. Lowest often Wickham Wanderers. That's a bit of a mismatch. I don't even know where Lowest oft are. Southern Premier Central. There you go. Um, Leighton Orient and Bristol Rovers. I could see that being like an actual game that would happen in like a cup competition. Northampton and Celtic. There you go. Bit of a strange one. Sheffield United, Locomotive Moscow. It's a bit of a interesting one. West Ham and Partizan. Hmm, fair enough. Hamburg and Chelsea. There you go. I quite like that. I'll support Hamburg in that one. I love Hamburg. I did a um, FIFA RTG with them in my free time back on FIFA 19. Maybe, yeah, FIFA 19, not 20. Loved them. I absolutely loved the Hamburg lads. Uh, they were great. I loved my Hamburg team. Let's go to the team selection. I think that looks good. Other than this, who... Uh, I guess we just do that, and then this guy can be replaced on the bench. By I'll have to be this guy. I think that's a solid team. Mitch Brundle, yeah, I'll let Mitch Brundle take the armband. That sounds like a good shout to me. I don't know if having this guy with an attacking mid is gonna really work out while the rest of our mid is sort of in a line and having this guy push more forwards, it might not work out, but against Rochdale, I really am expecting to lose. I think they're just a better team. Uh, I just think, oh, obviously they're so much higher than us as well. But uh, I think, try the first team, to see what they're like. Because uh, it's just pre-season friendly, and then we can, you know, move along and, and use, um, and use lesser, um, uh, more fringe players at the times. So, uh, team talk. Defense. Uh, let's just say... Go the bottom ones. They didn't really have any particular reaction. That that is cool. Let's just start playing. See if anything happens. Okay. So actually, don't know which. Uh, so we are playing in the white. Uh, they are playing in the grey. The white, red, and blue is us, and the blue and grey is them and we've let a goal in already it's been five minutes lads come on keeper you had to be doing better than that fella it was soft mate let's just skip it i don't really want to see them scoring just say get creative oh we're just gonna bang it into them aren't we bang it right up to one of their players Right, let's, let's just a little bit root one, but we we like that sometimes. Just smack it and see what's happening in this. That was a shocking ball, mate. What was that, buddy? Now they're breaking. Come on, get the tackle in. Good challenge. Needed to get on the end of it though, someone. Only about football managers, you never know what a highlight's going to be, and it's a second goal for them. Again, the keeper needs to be sharper there. Might want to change this up. Might want to go to a 4 2 3 1 wide. Because, yeah, currently this is not working. It's 15 minutes and we're 2 0 down. And obviously, it's Rochdale who are much better than us, but. You know, Will Wright's got himself on a yellow. All 
Right, it's coming up to half time. I will quick sub Western off. Uh, and who are we going to bring on? I think we'll bring on, yeah, this guy. Yon Lukwe. Uh, We're going to let in a third goal before half time. Come on. At least get an attack going, lads. Reed. Nice. Here we go. Starting to form a little bit of an attack here. The queen out wide. Hit it in the box. Weston header. It is a goal for us. Miles Weston with Alexander McQueen on the assist. There we go. That's what we wanted to see. Weston who's just about to come off. Signalling that he's not feeling great. Feeling very tired. About to come off and is leaving the field. Making a good impact. Uh, yes. Give the lad some praise for that. And then he's going to go and concede right now, aren't we? We're going to go concede as soon as I've been like, yes, well done, lads. We're going to go 3 1 down. Oh, great save, keeper. Well done. Defend the corner, lads. So close to half time. You don't want to let another one in. Get it away. Okay, it's fine. It went over the bar. Would have liked to have gotten it away, but, uh,. As long as it doesn't go in, then I am happy with that. Half time, nice, nice. That's good. I mean, two one down only. I'm I'm all right with that. Yeah, we've completely dominated. We've had one shot. It's gone on target, and we've scored. And they've had seventy percent possession. But I, I think I think there's some positives to take from that. I don't think it's great. Okay. Right. We need to tell them that they're, that we're disappointed. Right, there we go. To tell them I'm disappointed. I always go off what the uh what the assistant says to, to do. Here we go. And we lose the ball. You know, I thought we had something going. I saw us attacking, I'm like, yes, come on. And of course this highlight is is them attacking, not us. You need to be covering your man there, number 24. Look at the space that they have. I'm giving them just too much to work with here, and they've got a good opportunity, and they've gotten another goal. Luke Matheson, the assist. Tyler Smith, the goal. Luke Matheson, who I believe is now contracted to Wolves, but was still loaned out to Rochdale for the rest of the season. I can't remember. Right, I want to be more attacking now. I think that's what we need. Here we go. Yes, there we go. Alex Reed was Alexander McQueen on the assist again. I believe that's his second assist of the game. What we wanted, we're bringing it back. Give the lads some praise there. Don't need to see it again as much as I do love seeing my goals. I don't go and concede again, boys. It's been like two minutes. I think I am going to actually change to a 4 2 3 1 wide. Just to, uh, just to see. Oh, they've got a pen. Jeez, I wasn't paying attention. They've got a penalty. It's going in. Keeper's not saving it. Penalties in this game almost always go in. Yeah. Fair enough. Alright, uh, we'll make some subs on the hour mark. Yeah, around about now. So we can make just a ton of subs, so I just say we... We, uh, actually, I say we bring this lad off. Bring off the guys that are on bookings. Uh, bring on, uh, I think doing pretty well. Mm. Let's leave that as it is. 
Uh, you know, let's just change the keeper just to have a look at what the other keepers like. Just because it is a friendly, doesn't really matter. I say we actually, I'm saying we do that as well. Just make a bunch of changes. Uh, just because we can, it's a friendly, why not? They're going to whip that into a goal. Good save, keeper, well done. What we like to see. Strizovic coming on and making a good impact early on. Good ball up. If we can find anything from it. Reed. Uh, to Honorius. Oh, that's a great ball. That is a great ball. That's a great goal. What a goal. Emmanuel with the assist. Alex Reed with the goal. That was brilliant play by the boys. I want to watch that one again. Speed it up a little bit. But this assist we need to watch in slow-mo. Look at him just searching, searching. Finds that ball over the top. Finds it read perfectly. Takes one touch outside of the box and smacks it home. That is beautiful. And we're going to go and concede again now, aren't we? Well, at least you've been treated for goals in this. And it's uh, currently 4-3 and it's not even the 70th minute yet. Oh, we've just let Matheson go free. You can't let Luke Matheson go free. A great goal by them. Luke Matheson again. That little lad is special. Little fella who has the, such a baby face. If you ever look at a picture of him, he is a complete child. Wait, can I? Ah, oh, it doesn't show him. It doesn't show his face. Um, you know, I say we can. No, attacking's good. Just pause to see if there's anything I want to change. I think we just we just go with it. Creative. There we go, I've inspired a few players. Alex Reed having a good game, which is nice. We like to see it. I'm actually gonna make a couple more subs. Just because I can. Um and it's a friendly, so I may as well. Gonna leave Alex Reed on for the whole 90. And then anything else? Anyone else I can swap for a position that hasn't? No, okay, so we're just gonna make those subs just basically just give a few lads some time on the pitch when they normally wouldn't get any. Uh, we're gonna lose 5 3, but I'm okay with that. Um, oh, it could be 6 3. We were always gonna lose. I came into this knowing for a fact we're going to lose, but we scored three goals, which I'm happy with. Um, kind of want time now here, but we're not going to quite get it, and they are going to get a sixth, I think. They are going to get a sixth right on the, the brink of full time. It's a sixth goal for them, still just three for us. Not a great result, I'll be honest, and that will be full time. Yeah, it is a disappointing result. I think, you know, if it had been like 4-3, maybe 5-3 would have been alright, but 6-3, not great. Tell them I'm disappointed. Hand over to the assistant. There we go. Get a few of the results there. Uh, so next match is another friendly in just three days time. Hopefully we might have uh, an injured player back for that. Quick save by the game. Thank you football manager for quick saving. Because I would forget. Um. Well, where do we need to improve? Anderson set for Eastley, so we didn't get him. That's annoying. Oh, but it's okay. We can we can find some other players. Mm. 
Reese Taylor, where did you play? You goalkeeper? Okay, I don't think we need a keeper. Central striker. 21. Mm. 21. Attacking midfielder? Okay. Actually, no, I'm going to change these tactics around because I think... Um, This is what I want to change. I think we're going to go with the, the 4 2 3 1 wide. Uh, then swap these two over. So, where do you play? He's a central striker. Okay, so I think we need to swap him out for this guy. And then. Houses are yes. Yeah, so I'm gonna swap house for Reed. I think that might just work a bit better for us. Um, see this guy. Is he looking better? Mm. No, I think we're gonna stick with Deering there so that shows that if we can find one uh if we can edit search that's what we need Let's see who wants him so a few players want this lad that could be good right mid which is what we need 29 year old irishman donald mcdermott uh, okay I think we go in for McDermott. I think we can just agree with that. I think Lionel Cole as well looks like he could be quite good for us. So I think we're going to go in for him as well. So do that as it is. Um. Then where else do we need? Then else I think maybe. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Right. So Candy looks like he could be quite good in this role. Is nice. does bring our intensity down a bit because we see their uh, familiarity even but i think i think i think this could work i i, I like the look of that but i think we move on continue a bit uh we'll play this second match and then that will be it for this episode injury update so He's, Kenny Clark is back, which is nice, so I think we can probably get him into the team somewhere, so where are you, Kenny Clark? Oh, who do we, do we get you in straight away, or do we... Hmm. I think we do that as a swap. Yeah, okay. That's good. Next on red, continue. I didn't properly read that last message. What did that say? Okay. okay so he could be something. Where does he play? He plays a central defender. Any names I've heard of here? No. No. Ethan Miller, a right back? I think we go. I think we can go in for Ethan Miller. 
okay. But, uh... I think we should add a transfer target. Yeah, then we can look at our transfer target. So, like, if I go transfers, then director of football transfer targets, we can we can look in for him there. Um, inbox again. Uh. This lad looks. Who's warning him? I think uh, we'll add him as a transfer target as well. I think we just move on to the next thing. I can always come back to that. Um, okay, nice, nice. Okay, that's not what we wanted. Um. Transfers, director of football, transfer targets, Ethan Miller, contract, contract offer, okay, so he's on a trial day, so I'll, I'll go in and do that myself. Anything exciting going on with these games? Any crazy games going on? Uh, nothing I'm seeing just yet. Uh, looking like there's no wild fixtures. Um, Ajax Brighton, there you go, that's a bit of a mad one. Wouldn't have expected to see that one. Uh, Leeds, Grenoble. FC St. Pauli and Norwich as well. Um, so a lot of these are uh, like youth teams playing each other. Reading Arsenal, I mean that was like something you used to see in the Prem twice a year at one point was Reading and Arsenal. Uh, but not anymore because Reading are now a championship side. Brentford and Manchester United, that could be an exciting one, uh, which we are going to see next season in the Prem, which is going to be good. I'm excited for Brentford in the Prem, I think they could be interesting. I think Brentford are either going to be a Leeds or like a West Brom uh, in relation to like the season just gone. Because Leeds in the season just gone, they were exciting, they were great fun to watch, they were sick. Everyone was like, oh Leeds are really interesting. Uh, whereas everyone just kind of forgot West Brom existed. So I think, uh, I think that's what could be of Brentford in the upcoming season in the Prem. They could, I think they're going to go either one of the ways nothing in between they're either just going to get straight relegated and everyone's going to forget they exist by november or they're going to be really exciting to watch throughout the whole season everyone's going to be like oh man i'm glad these guys are promoted again let's go let's go for it and see how we do don't know what this team are like that we're up against, so I don't know whether we should be winning, whether we shouldn't be. Uh, let's make the changes. So we are in the white and red. They are in the blue, just so you are aware. You weren't quite sure. Oh, come on, you've just let your man go too easily there. Come on, man. Who was that? Number 17, I think it was. That was that was crap. Tighten up, lads. Tighten up. Let the man go. Come on, boys. We need to be better than this. I think we go to a, a go more attacking because clearly we're not attacking at all here. I'll just let them get through again. That that was offside. Oh, I thought that was off. Come on, lads. It's 21 minutes in. I don't even know where this team are from. And we're 2-0 down. Show some passion, lads. Come on. I'm about to go 3-0 down within 30 minutes. Like, come on. We're acting as if this team are prime Barcelona. Like, come on, win. Not great, but we're not that bad, fellas. Uh, someone should be on that. Look at that. Good save by the keeper. But 
we need to be better. Not happy with the lads here. Not happy with them at all. Well. Come on, the second half needs to be a lot better. Not happy with the lads so far, not happy at all. There we go. At least we had something. In almost an hour we've had absolutely nothing until just then. We actually got something that was relatively okay. Don't let them do this. Oh come on, you've just let them, you've given them free space to roam and now it's going to be three, no it's not, it's a good save by our keeper. We need to be better than this lads, we've been, we've been shit. Come on, we're all inspired by the feedback, let's, let's go and get ourselves at least a goal in this. There we go, that's what we need to be doing and house just losing out too easily. But we've still got possession. Let's just push forwards. There we go. That could be beautiful. Oh, and House wasted it. Wasted opportunity, mate. Come on, this is actually some something positive that I can look at and be like, yeah, this is good. We're just going to go all out attack now. We need to get something in. Oh, so close. Should have scored, though. We definitely should have scored there. Right, we've got a second chance today. Let's score this time, lads. And it's gone over the bar. Come on. I think maybe the very attacking bit was, was wrong. I think just attacking. We're just letting this man, Martin, go free all the time. It's not a good showing by us. After a, a disappointing but not shocking showing in first game against uh, against Rochdale, this has just been awful. I'm going to make a bunch of subs after this. Come on, there we go. That's what we needed. What a goal, Harold, mate. That is a great goal. If I could shout some praise at you right now, I definitely would. That's what we've been needing. Ben House with the assist. Harold was... Odometi with the goal. Pause the game. Uh, I'm gonna make a bunch of subs. We're just gonna sub the keeper here. Uh, Miles Weston can come off. Kenny Clark, we can get you on. Alex Reed can come on. Um. Um, Deering can come on, and we'll get Harry Phipps on as well. Let's make a bunch of subs. Um, maybe we can actually get something out of this. Let's just go all out attack for the rest of it. We've got nothing to lose now. Uh. Um, don't really have anyone we can do that as a sub. Make all the subs we really can. Yeah, so that's that's all the subs we can really make. Gonna drop it though. A two-one loss is what this is looking like. It's gonna be. It's a very disappointing result, all things considered. We should have had at least a draw out of that. Gonna get a little bit aggressive. Be a bit more calm. But yeah, not the best for us. Really not the best. There we go, we get to see some of the results from elsewhere. How did Brighton fare against Ajax? That's what I want to know. 
Lost 3-2. That doesn't surprise me that much. Newcastle scored in the second minute. There you go. Any other big weird games? What the biggest results? A 4-1 win there. 3 0 win there, 2 0 win, 3 0 win. Nothing major, 4 1 for Chelsea over Luton. 3 0s. A 4 0 for FCM, so that French team. Uh, their secondary side against. Owners, the Swiss team. Alright. I have fun. I'm feeling, feeling like having fun. Let's do a uh do another one. Over this side a trial, see if we get anything. Knowledge. Um yeah, you can approach the side eventually. Do the uh, transfers. And Miller, are you still on? Yeah, still on a trial. Okay, that's good. We got a trial with uh, with uh, Aminu Mohammed, which is cool. Yeah, we got him for a week. That's kind of the point of the trial, is we're not sure. That's why we're taking him on trial. So we can learn to see if he's good or not. Yes, I'm cagey with the media because I'm being stupid. Thank you. I appreciate when players are like that, when you're like, listen mate, I've been really disappointed with you in training, and they're like, you know what, yeah, I should be better. I'm like, okay, thank you, you're working with me here. Uh -oh. Looking around at what we got. Still injured. He's a striker, so I think we'll put him in place of Reese Grant for the moment. Uh, and obviously, that's only just for a week. So we'll go to this third game against Newton Borough. Arnold Cole, we yeah we we've made a offer for him. A offer, an offer, even is the correct terminology. Uh, let's just go into this game. I think. We just go with this team again, uh, and then we can. I'll bring off um, Mohammed off the bench at some point. Discover we should be winning this one. We're wearing a yellow kit today, so when we get into to the uh, highlights, then you'll need then uh, if we will be looking out for the yellow kit. That is us. There we go, yellow kit. That is our team. So cheer on the yellow kit, lads. 
not the blue and white kit because that is our opposition. This one we should be winning, but I've got a, just got a bad feeling. His name is Pickles, come on. We cannot concede to a man named Pickles. And we don't, but stupid goal to concede. Terrible clearance by McQueen as well, one of our star players. We we'll demand more of our players there. Play a bit more attacking now that we go down. Oh, I've lost all pace, lads. Come on. Bring some pace into the attack. We're just losing out on possession like that when we shouldn't be. We still got possession, but wasted opportunity. Come on. Header. Just over the bar. That came off the bar. We need to be scoring, lads. That's our problem. We let in so many goals, we don't score any. Look at this, we give them so much open space. I think maybe the Route 1 is going to work better for us than than uh, how we're currently playing with the wing play. I mean, what was that? Right, come on, mate. And there, you're selling McQueen an absolute hospital pass. At least we got that ball cleared away. There we go. McQueen's good. I like McQueen quite a lot. Here we go. This could be a goal and it's just wide. I could have sworn that had gone in. Okay, they're inspired by the feedback. I'll sub him. Yeah, I'll sub. Sub him off. Eddie Clark, you can come on. As it is just a friendly. Show some passion, lads. Come on. We're 1 0 down. It's coming up to the end of the half. Try and actually get something out of this game, eh? There we go. That's what we needed. A great ball house. Come on, mate. Come on, fellas. Disappointed. Just cannot win games here. Come on. Let's actually get let's get at least a draw. If we get a draw or at least be something. I mean going back to right like that. Why? I mean unless right's gonna play an absolute pearler of a ball, which he is. Will right, I take back what I said. There we go. Encourage the lads. That's good, let's keep going on that, let's keep building upon what we've just done. A absolute view of a ball by Will Wright to get that. Okay, so to make that sub, um, we're gonna get this lad on. We're gonna give him some good time on the pitch. Are we lacking? Say, yeah, that is a change as well. A triple sub. Come on, boys, let's do something. Here we go. The breaking. The trial. Ah. Oh. Glad he was on trial, just lost out, but we've still got possession here, we can still break. And go forwards. Here we go. Oh, could be a great ball. Oh, what a ball, what a goal. Sam Deering assisting our lad on trial. I mean, if you're going to score like that for us, sign on a permanent, please, fellow. That was beautiful. A great goal. Great assist as well. Very happy with that. Keep encouraging the lads. They're all frustrated by the feedback. Okay. Sorry lads, didn't mean to. Uh, let's make 
make a couple more subs, change keeper again just to give the other keeper a bit of time on the pitch. Uh, let's just change that up, change that up, and I think that'll be all the changes we make for this game. We don't have anyone to change them all for, so we're just going to leave them on. We finish the game. We win two one, which isn't too bad. We get the we get the win, which is nice. Just do uh, like I'm pleased with your your efforts. There we go. That's good. At least we got a win. Um, we look decent. We look like the better team, I think. Um, overall, happy that we that we won a game. But anyway, I think. Uh, Hmm. I say we approach to sign this guy. Ooh. There we go. I think yeah, I think that will do for today. Um but yeah we got a good start. Um I think we're doing well. Uh, I mean, it's still just learning, and I'm still definitely much, definitely very much just a learning football manager as a person. So it's it's, a, it's we're getting places. Like we're starting something and gonna keep building on it, and hopefully get actually good at football manager and maybe do well in the league. Maybe um maybe have a decent season. But anyway, that is the end of episode one of the Dagenham and Redbridge Football Manager series. So thank you for watching, and I will catch you in episode two.